Hey guys, Travis Cook here, learning how to think. So we had the protest in London today and it went off. I'm very, very proud of my fellow British people. Because uh, yeah, they've done a great job. Looks like everyone had a great time and it was totally peaceful right till the end. I mean, even the beginning, there was a minute silence for that police officer that died. I mean, how beautiful is that? But then right at the end, the police came in and um, from what I'm told, it was to try and stop Dr. Heiko, this German um, German man, from talking. Par possibly because his message was so powerful, I'm not sure. But right at the end, they come in and they, 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 they stormed into the stage. And they were really brutal, eh? I mean, you see the, the reaction the BLM protesters get and the police are taking the fucking knee. The fucking knee? They're kneeling for these fuckers. And... At an anti-lockdown protest, they're coming in with batons, riot gear, and they're pushing over old women, and it's, oh, it's infuriating. Um, but no, it, it looked like it went really well. So I'm, I've got a little collection of footage here. Um, big ups to Active Patriot for the live stream. I was watching that, supporting that. I shared that everywhere I could. And uh, big ups to everybody who caught footage of it, because there was a lot of stuff to capture and um, so here's uh, some of the collection of footage that I've you know, managed to find and uh, full credit to everyone who got all this footage. You're doing a great job and it really feels like the revolution is happening, folks. It's even happening in fucking government with the Tories rebelling against all of this and it's happening on the streets. Um, so yeah, just check, check some of this out. Shame on you! Shame on you! Shame on you! 
Hey, what you say? Hey! Take him round the back. Take him round the back. Take him round the back. This is a disgrace. Anything to say, sir? Yes, sir. One minute, sir. What do you think of that, huh? Looks pretty intense, doesn't it? And it's just frustrating because I'm. The what? Please take a side. What are you going to do? You are literally, you are helping tyranny roll out on your very own streets. You are beating the very people who are protect. You are paying your salary. It's insanity. And so the Daily Mail had an article about this. This time they didn't delete the comments. Not yet, anyway. Even though it's gotten like thirteen thousand comments and huge support for all of this. And I think this is the start of something huge. I mean, it's been building up, building up, building up. The numbers are going up. I mean, I'm hearing, um, you know, 30,000, 50,000. It's a lot of people. You see some of these pictures. It looks awesome, man. And uh, yeah, so you've got these comments. Got, everyone's, you know, it's really building up the momentum. So it certainly gets me hyped. And I did everything I could to promote it in the online world. Uh, I couldn't be there today. But my heart was with you guys. You can you can re you can be sure of that. So uh, hopefully the momentum keeps going and we get the fuck out of this COVID bullshit, huh? Because we're like day eight, one hundred and eighty of fifteen days of flatten the curve. You fucking had enough yet? You had enough? I think we're starting to have a fuck enough. So let's see where this goes. And uh, big ups to every single person who is involved with this. You are heroes. I love you.